Shekina. Shekina. There goes Hebrews 4, the blood of, and Jesus said it is. Jinaango ni Victoria Mwangi. Ushuhuda ni kona nyingi sana zimeja. Lakini nitasema ya leo ya mchanga. Kwa sababu leo ni siku ya deliverance. Kabla niaze nitasema so long as umeingia pale. Na jikumbuka siku ya kwanza niliingia pale. I know your life will never be the same. Na ninasema hivyo because my life has never been the same. Ju nilikuja hapa na mahangaiko. Nilikuja hapa na msoto. Nilikuja hapa nikiwa... Hey, hey, chini, 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 chini. Like it dry, 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 dry. Like it mungu wa meninua. So wacha niseme ushuhuda ya, kutu, ya, ya kuendea mchanga. So nilikuja na nikasikiliza na nikaendea mchanga. <laughs> and the one thing nitasema ni kufunguka kulifunguka. Nitatua ushuhuda ya kazi. Ukiniona ni mesimama hapa ama ni kikuja hapa. Nilikuwa, niliwachishwa kazi 2012 January. Na line yako ni, ni gani Victoria? Line. Line line yako career choice yako ama job description? <laughs> Imeenda ikibadilika ikibadilika. Kwa sasa ni gani? Kwa sasa ninafanya maneno ya social na environment. Mm, my NGO NGO. My NGO NGO hivi nafanya ma study kuanza katikati na ikiisha. Hey, hey, na akili imefunguka hata zingine zinafunguka lakini hiyo ni testimony ya key of David. Washa ni sema ya mchanga. Ya mchanga ni kwamba, in, in 2011, I was working for one of the biggest banks in Kenya. Banks. Banks mm. in Kenya. Benki. So, e, e, Benki. So, nilikuwa uh, kwa department ya risk. Risk na fraud control. Sisi njo tunatafuta, wa, si unajua watu. Wale walo. Wale wa, e, e, wandani, wa inje, kila pahali. Mm. So, it's a very sensitive department. Wale ambao hawajamaliza na loan. Apana, watu wamefanya fraud, watu okay. wameiba, watu wame, unaona, wanaija hivi, ma ATM, makadi, account, my employees wale pia wana, wana, wana collide na watu wengine kufanya nini? Kuiba. So tulikuwa kwa hiyo department, na hiyo department is a very sensitive department, okay? So 2011 October, nikapewa Inaitu aje promotion. Lakini promotion ni ya mdomo. So barua ilikuja 2011 um, December. Sasa ukipewa barua sindio utalipo ya kutoka ile siku. Ulipewa juu ili bakdetua mpaka October. So hiyo December nilikuwa najua ni meiva. Na salari yangu ilikuwa imefikisha six ngapi? Six figure. Six figure. Sasa December ilikuwa tuku? Kuhepi. Kuhepi. Chani siseme siku hizo siku nilikuwa kuhepi kabisa. Na kupeana. So January vile nilirudi. I mean January sindio sasa na, nakula mshahara ya kwanza sasa vizuri. Ya, ya hii kazi nimefanya promotion. Still within the same department. Ata hii kufika tarehe ilikuwa ine. Ati imeisha kazi. Even the people there. Kwa sababu risk department inakuwaga na department yake. Na kila mtu wake. System inaisha, wanatuniambia pana, wo usiende, there was a mistake. What take? Number one, performance ilikuwa A+. Plus. Huko mnafanyaga performance every quarter. So performance yangu ilikuwa sa, iko? Na siya ti hiyo time peke yake, imekuwa ikikuwa sawa. Umeshika. So why am I being, na nimepewa barua hata sijakula mshahara. So nikaka, but uh, around uh, 12th, nikaitua na director na ule mtu wa HR wa hapo. Wakasema hata si tumeshanga, lakini usijali, laki barua ndiyo hii. I didn't even know what to say. Nikaenda nyumbani, na ndiyo saa hiyo maisha nimeanza ya, nikona katutoka dogo, kutukangu kalizaliwa, ni 2011. Ama eh, hapo, likuwa mdogo, ajafikisha one year. <laughs> Sasa ni kuenda, unashanga, umeona nini hapa na imeenda. And since that day, wacha nifanya fast forward. Ata hakuna job ni meapply kaingia. Hakuna ata kuniambia, unfortunately, we have received your application, unfortunately. Since 2012. Since 2012, January. Kukanyamaza ndi. Kukanyamaza ndi. Hai, ata maji, maji ya mtungi inapigaga kelele. Yangu ilinyamaza na ikanyamaza na ikanyamaza. Hadi lini, Victoria? Hey. 
<laughs> ni November la sijuzi hii nikikuja kwa Shekaina. Ndio ulikuja Shekaina Victoria. Ndio nilikuja Shekaina. Na nilikuja Shekaina kwa sababu my sister has been here na yeye alikuwa amefanya mambo. So vile siku moja namwambia nimeanza kuona tu vitu tunapata. Akaniambia ni ile maombi nafanya na ndio akaniambia kuja hapa lakini mimi sikukua wa kukuja hapa. So unasema kwamba dada yako alikuwa ameshaanza kukuja hapa. Kukuja hapa. Na ukaanza kuona tu job job hapa na pale. Nikapata ya kwanza. Sasa akinipigia jua shazo eh. Namwambia siko niko kwa basi naenda na manga naenda sijui. Ai akaniambia kwani umeanza biashara. Nikamwambia hapana. Umeshika hii story. So nikamwambia nimeenda pahali job. Ilikuwa tu job kidogo. Mm. Akaniambia ni maombi because unaona you are a performer number 2 usiati hauna papers number 2 mia mawaka nikisema nitafanya kitu nitafanya Amen. so akaniambia kuja ile kanisa mpaka tukifika hata unaniambia unaona pale ah namwambia pana but i came and when i came my life sasa ndio haijawahi kukua so fast forward nikaenda nikapeleka mchanga mm. <laughs> sasa ni sepe aje hey. Ndiyo hizo zikaanza kukuja. And I remember I stood here the second time, the second Wednesday nilikuja. Hata kukua na jua na kuja, I already had my testimony. Amen. Na nakuambia sasa zimefunguka. Ulipo michanga. <laughs> Nilipo endea michanga. Uliendea ya upande gani sababu dada yako alikuwa medil na ya wazazi wako. Dada yangu alikuwa medil na wazazi wangu na alikuwa medil pia na pande ya maathe. Yes. Lakini kuna zile azikuwa. Kuna moja ya, ya babu haikuwa imefanywa na ya shosho hata tujui kapuriko hapi. Lakini vile tuli, nilikuwa naenda, ndiyo siku tulipewa master key. Na master key ni kiomba nayo ilinionesha all the dark places pali vitu mbaya ziko. Ukiomba na iyo oracle master, master key. key. Ukonyeshwa maono. Ma, hey, hey. Na nikiuliza na ambiwa, pale uliona uwe ndi alikuwa mama yao wa uchawi. Aha. Huko chini ndiyo kulikuwa na shiraini ile ilikuwa inatolewa madhabahu. Na misi kukuwa hizo siku. Waze wale watatu niliona na ambiwa, kwenyu nyisi weupe, kwenyu nyisi weusi, ni hao walikuwa natuwa madhabahu. So God showed me, alinirilivia kila kitu. So nilipoendea mchanga, siku endea tu ya kaburi, niliendea ya those places yes. that nilioneshwa, ukarabati ilikuwa inafanyiwa. Kabisa. Na nikachukua na nikakuja nazo. Na siku kuzwa. Hey, na zilikuwa zina poromoka hapa hata. I think nilikuwa na fly. Amen. Kwa sababu na fikiri huko kwetu vitu zilikuwa mbaya. Na hatu kuwa tunajua. And I'm telling you, the first breakfast, hata siku pata kazi ya hapa. Nilipata ya nikienda. Ukiendanga nje bwana. Nikiendanga nje passport yangu. Si tulisema tunakonek na testimonies. Amen. Emu kikesu makofi bwana. Shangilia ni kama ni yako. Amen. Kwa chaku poeka. Amen. Kwa kwa ni ufunguo, ufunguo sawa sawa. Amen. So vituru nasema zikanda kupopop. He. Na siyo za local. Ata si local. Ata sai ni kikufungulia email yangu kwa simu. Zingine ata na wambia sasa. Eh. Kwa sababu naona speed na naona ile side mungu na nipeleka hata niko confused. Halilu. Mimi ule siku hata napata, he, siku agata na fair. Sa zingine nasema nimekuja hata sijui ntarudi aje. Hmm. Eh? Ndiyo huyo nimepanda ndege marangapi. Sinilienda november. Come on. Nimepanda maranane. Hey, hey. Eight of them. Hii passport yangu mpia nilipata vile nilipata breakthrough hapa. Pigia yesu makofi. Siku wana passport nikipata hiyo job ya kuenda inje. Inweni Siku wana passport. Inweni mikono. Ata siyo lazimo kuena leakage. Amen. Atizi milango zitafunguka aje. Amen. Wewe connect. Tundesema Father in the name of Jesus. Father in the name Wewe of Jesus. Wewe subatu inuwa mikono kabisa. Sema baba katika jina la yesu. Baba katika jina la yesu. I connect. I connect. Mi kama pastor Merian. Amen. I connect with Victoria's testimony. I connect. Milango zake zimefunguka. Amen. Pia mimi zangu zimefunguka. Amen. In the mighty name of. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Pigia yesu makofi shangwe vigele gele. Amen. Eh, ati nane. Sasa. Eh, hiyo pas, passport hile ya before. Aki ya ijawa istampiwa mara moja. Nilichukua 2009. It can expire in after 10 years. 2019, ata ijawai stampiwa. Hii ingine nilipata ni November. Ni November. Sa hii me stampiwa mara ngapi? Mara nane. Mara nane. So, is it, mungu wa hapa, this is a, is, is a true altar. Thank you, Lord. And it is a living altar. Amen. Si jamaliza badu kwa kufungukiwa. 
<laughs> Sasa simu peke yangu. I remember hata nikitoa testimony na shangaa nikisema maneno ya school fees. Area zilisha. Amen. <laughs> Madeni zilisha. Amen. Usiangaliage mtu unaona unaona deni uko nayo kwa kemis juu uko na watoto, uko nayo kwa mama mboga, uko nayo kwa Filipo, unaenda huku kwa ule mama mwingine uko nayo. Sasa hata una change njia. <laughs> Lakini Mungu alikuwa tu anadisa stay siku hizi naenda hata nanunulia mtu wa duka soda because alinishikilia that time when I didn't have Hallelujah. so vitu zimefunguka areas zimeisha madeni zimeisha cycles zile mbaya yes. ati unajua sasa ukikatiwa stima next ni maji tena ndio hiyo nyumba tena ndio hiyo school fees yani paka unashangaa had given up because it was a cycle that was never ending ika so milango zimefunguka na zile mbaya nazo zikafungwa amen eh hizi za addictions za hadarati mamogoka mamogoka zikaisha ati mimi nilikuwa ati nauza ba 2021 eh huyu mrembo huyu anakaa kuchu mogoka nilikuwa na chonga nilikuwa na vuta hata bangi ndio nilikuwa nimeanza 2021 na saini kama sijawahi shika Amen. pombe sisi kwetu hey, ya, 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 ya. nilikuwa naikunywa mm. eh nilikuwa naikunywa lakini saa hii hata ni kama sijawahi yonja so come kuja endea mchanga Amen. na bado if you are new ni mara yako ya first kukuja Amen. ukimaliza hii kuko na ingine mm-hmm. sasa hiyo ndiyo maduo si ya, 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 ya. sasa hiyo ukikuja umalizane just listen Amen. tea me i have seen god na victoria nikuulize ndoa yako inakaje iko sawa sasa zile shida unajua let me tell you ukikuwa uko uko na suffocation hakuna pesa kwani mtafurahi hakuna hakuna shida nyingi na kuaga pesa unakasirika juu ya hii na hii so sasa vitu ziko sawa shida si ati azijaisha ziko but hizo ni shida sasa si niko na tools zote najua i know how to go down on my knees so this altar is real and this altar is now see give up kuja mimi nilikuwa ni kuja nikiwa was and i know the best is yet to come Imagine. because everywhere i'm going i swear ni favor ni favor hata na shangaa mimi mwenyewe mtu hata sijamaliza first year anniversary na itakuwa anniversary jo i must celebrate the day i came to shekina ni next month mimi nita celebrate because i know what he has done for me hallelujah so kuja vile huko don't give up and i'm telling you the minute umeingia pale it will never never be the same again huyu mungu wa hii altar mungu wa pastor wa apostol miriam ni mungu akisemaga anafanyaga aendagi mara mbili and we are lucky we have somebody anapata direct sasa si tuko hiyo ni mwa kenya hiyo si ni direct so ukikuja hapa umepata favor so mungu asifiwe and i know the best is yet to come yes. amen